Hi, this is Jackie coming at you from the Stitch and Post. Today we're going to do a very short video about our new line of fabric. It's seven bolts. It's called Color Collage by Northcott and it's all collage fabrics. It comes in red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, pink, the whole rainbow. We did little wallet kits out of it and I have made wallet samples so you can see those and I just wanted to explain one more time about our little acrylic template which is this here and how to use it again to especially on the collage fabric because there's so much that you can do with it so what I did here is I opened up a kit and laid it out each kit comes with two fat eighths pieces of fabric one is for the top and one is for the inside and then you can use what you want for the pockets there's enough to do either or it also comes with a piece of interfacing to give it some stability, a sew on snap, but you can also use, we have the pearl snaps that I don't have in here right now, but we do have a video about that. I use the pearl snaps on my little wallets here. And these are the kits that we have. There's seven different ones, one in each color. So as you can see the fabric, when you open it up, there's so much going on in it. There's so many things that you can make with that you can cut out. So this is the little template. And I added to it some lines using this glow line tape to make it easier for whoever. I've done so many of these, I don't really need it. But if you're beginning, you can get an idea of what you're going to see when you cut your fabric out. So it's clear, so it's a little hard to see. Maybe the lines will make it a little bit easier. Now, when you're doing these little wallets, if you look at this one, it's upside down, which is not good, but when you close it, the cats are going the correct direction. You need to remember that if you're doing directional fabric, which this fabric is. So you need to lay your template on the fabric basically so it's upside down. I don't know, it'd be easier for you. Sometimes it's easier if you turn your fabric and then you can read it, but then you need to remember to take the template and make the, the curve part of it, which is the front here towards you and then you'll see what you're going to get so i'm going to move and i put a little line here with the glow tape this is what you're going to see on your wallet front minus the little quarter inch seam around the outside here okay so i'm laying it on here and here i can get the word green which is pretty cool if i move it over here i can end up with a frog and a bunch of other little things in there very collagey cut that or i can move it over here and get some cactuses you need to make sure that the back of your template is actually on the fabric, okay? That's as far as I can go to the edge. So that is what you're going to see on the front of your wallet. Move it over here. Maybe you want a little umbrella. Again, that is what you're going to see. Move it over here. Get a, get a frog and some puzzle pieces. But if you look off to the side here, I'm a little off the edge. So you'll want to move it over. That's what you'll get. Okay, you'll still get your frog, get pink cushion or whatever that is. Now, say there's something up here that you really want. If there's words in it, it's going to be upside down. But if there's no words, you could get away with an upside down queen head. But you could go over here, your car's going to be upside down. But does that matter to you? Or you can even turn it this way. If you decide that you want all this sewing, seam binding, again, your words will be sideways at that point. But that's up to you, whatever you want to do. I, mean, I kind of like that card. That's kind of cool. When you start looking at it, there's so much going on in here, and every one of them offers. They're not the same little pictures on each one of these. They could be different. Uh, you might not see a frog in a bowl on any of these others. But any, if you forget what the color is, say you're colorblind, the words are right on there. Like this one says green. That's green. Red has red on it. Orange has orange. Look, pink. It's pink. So you know what your colors are. So that is what I have to offer you. I just wanted to show you the tools that I use. I use the little Kai scissors. I use the Ofa ro rotary cutters. I have both these here. We got our little tape, got our pattern, got our kits, and got our template. So get yourself a template. Thank you. Have a great day.